Good evening, my name is Nick Andrew and I'm posting a little um, video response to Rob Goose's uh, video about the intervals that are used in the verse of Metal Fatigue by Alan Holdsworth. Um, we're having a little online debate on Facebook about, um, I mean, talk about geeky. We were talking about whether um, it's a fourth or a fifth that is the pitch shifting that's used in Metal Fatigue. And uh, quite rightly, Rob said it was a fourth. And he's right, because when you watch his video, you'll see Rob is from the future. Mm. Um, and he's a fantastic guitar, an amazing guitar player. So uh, there's no reason to doubt him. Um, the reason I thought it was a fifth is because years ago when I tried it, in about 1990, pitch shifters were crap, to be honest. And... Um, the fifth probably sounded better than the fourth, <laughs> but I'll do examples of both anyway, so you can hear the difference. So this is how I, this is how I play it um, using a fourth. Forgive my playing. I haven't done this for a while. Um, and you can hear a fourth sounds pretty good. When you get down to the... Um, it, it just all kind of fits together, basically. Um, the only bit I'm not too sure about, and you might be able to help me with this, is the little how long bit. The... Um, sure if that's right or not um i've never ever been able to pick that up so if anybody can help me play that bit i'll be very grateful anyway robert you're absolutely dead right i'm sorry i doubted you but you can hear it on the record that that's a fourth on the top definitely just to show you what it sounds like with a fifth doesn't sound bad at all does it um in fact it sounds almost just as good but it's not right on the top there so i'm using my tc electronic um nova system for the delay and the reverb and um i've taken no care on the delay and reverb at all i haven't checked any of alan holdsworth settings so Whatever that is, that's what I've put on it for today. Um, and I'm using my fantastic electroharmonics ring thing to get the, the fourths out. Um, absolutely brilliant pedal. Thank you very much, Rob, um, for your information. And uh, one should never doubt a man from the future who plays in an Alan Holdsworth tribute band. Um, that would be an absolute pleasure to hear you play sometime. So, yeah, thank you very much. And goodbye.